Hey, we're cooking with Cuckoo here. Dave Myers with Cuckoo for Cocoa representing the Cocoa Exchange products. And today we're going to make some pizza. Not only are we going to make some pizza, we're going to barbecue some pizza. And we're going to try to make it as simple as possible. Uh, the, the idea of this recipe came from the uh, uh, Backyard BBQ set. These books are priceless. If you get a set, barbecue set, freezer set, you get recipes. And these recipes are really nice to have. Gives you ideas. So, like today, it's given me an idea for some barbecue chicken pizza. We're gonna do that on the grill. So we, we've got some rotisserie chicken, um, and they seem to have those nowadays uh, in a good supply. I was there uh, last week and um, Sam's Club had them out ready to go right first of the morning. And I think, what does this take? A tablespoon of the sweet and spicy cocoa rub. I'm telling you, this baby is my favorite. And I'm getting a little bit uh, brave in my old uh, age, oh, whatever. And, 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 and so a uh, tablespoon of sweet and spicy cocoa rub uh, into the chicken. So, um, enough chicken to cover your flat bread, which you have. Um, uh, you can get baboli, you can make your own dough. Uh, once again, these were available there at Sam's Club, and these are really pretty doggone good. If you uh, go to the description of this video, you will find the entire recipe, uh, a link to it, to where you can download that recipe. Uh, and also, uh, I'm starting a little uh, 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 extra side thing of cuckoo notes, which will have the things that we've changed up a little bit on this. So, and by the way, my mom's here helping me because uh, I can't remember the dang uh, recipe. And, and uh, so if you hear her in there once in a while, that's, that's her because she's supposed to. Oh, so I guess I better give her the book for the recipe. Here, Mom. The recipe says two tablespoons on your, your oh, before I do that, I uh, put a little uh, olive oil. This was a different recipe, I think it might have been in a co uh, co uh, the, the uh, cocoa exchange. But I drizzle a little bit of olive oil over the thing. And because we're going to uh, put it on the grill, this last time we did this, this really made it good. Uh, rub that around a little bit. Um, oh yes, wash your hands, wash your hands. Okay, so we've got two tablespoons. We're going to do two tablespoons of barbecue sauce. Uh, the recipe in the book calls for sweet and smoky, the um, a Cocoa Exchange Pod and Bean Sweet and Smoky Barbecue Sauce. Um, excellent sauce. Love the sauce. I just used it last time, so this time I thought maybe we'll give it a little try with the Carolina sauce on it and see what, what that turns out like, see if we like it. So this is uh, pot and bean Carolina sauce. We are going to put approximately uh, two tablespoons. Yeah. Apparently, it's the chicken before the cheese. So we spread our chicken around. This rub makes the rotisserie chicken, which is really good in the first place, super special. Uh, look there, and kind of uh, got enough to have a little bit of chicken left over for the dog. Now uh, I'm going to, it was a, a thinly sliced red onion. That's what we put 
Put your cheese on here and that's what the uh, cocoa exchange recipe calls for. Taking a little bit extra step, I like stuff on my pizza. So today we're good. And you can put, as far as I'm concerned, you can put anything. I think it goes with the uh, um, barbecue. Uh, and so today I'm going to put some mushrooms and some olives. I'm going to put the olives on top of the cheese so it kind of has a little bit of contrast to the whole thing. So got my mushrooms on um, and just to be flavorful a little bit add color a little bit we got mozzarella cheese and a little bit of cheddar cheese going on top for color and um, the recipe does call for Monterey Jack but we're gonna go with this your olives that's the uh, uh, of course the photographer in me does want a little bit of prettiness to it uh, I, I think that the uh, uh, how you feel what you're eating and stuff uh, all it does have to do something with how it looks and hopefully we're gonna make this look pretty good and mostly um, my mom's been waiting three days because we've tried this shoot a couple of times, um, uh, waiting, waiting for this pizza for a long time, mouth-watering for pizza. I hope it is definitely worth the wait. So we've got your barbecued chicken pizza from the Coco Exchange, changed up a little bit with. Carolina barbecue sauce, the Cocoa Exchange barbecue sauce, and a few extra items, items added on there for flavor, color, and looks. And we're going to pop her into the grill here for 10 minutes. So there you go. Hey, okay, here we are with our barbecue chicken pizza. We got our Traeger grill uh, heated up to 350, and um, our neighbors decided to mow the lawn right when we wanted to do this video and uh, so um, what we're gonna do kind of according to the directions is uh, put a, a sheet of aluminum foil onto the bed of the grill now for me I don't know why I'm just doing it I'll let you know if it comes out okay uh, putting just a little bit of uh, olive oil around it um, kind of like, I don't know, it just sounded like a thing to do. And uh, we'll slide our pizza off onto here. Now depending on the type uh, you, of item you have for your crust, you're going to want to watch the time. I'm going to come back here in about 8 minutes, take a look. It says 8 to 10, 12 minutes. Um, so I'm going to come back and take a look in about eight minutes, see what that looks like. That's all there is to it. Okay, we're ready for the big reveal. Uh, it's been 10 minutes. And here it comes out of the smoker. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, baby, baby. There you go. Now that's a pizza for you. Pizza on the grill. There it is. I'm gonna take it in here, cut it up, and see what it tastes like. Okay, we've uh, let our pizza sit a couple of minutes, so we're gonna slice it up and see what she tastes like. Uh-oh, gonna have to taste the crappy one. Everything fell off. Mm. You wanna taste this piece? There you have it. Uh, barbecue chicken pizza on the grill with Cocoa Exchange products, Carolina barbecue sauce, 
sweet and spicy cocoa rub. And oh my goodness, it's really good. Really easy. It's Dave Myers with Cuckoo for Cocoa. Cooking with Cocoa, where we um, emphasize the Cocoa Exchange products. See you next time. Bye-bye. Okay, now, that's good. Well, I think it's absolutely delicious.